I just want to take a few minutes to bring our World Bible School teachers up to date on where we are in the current COVID-19 restrictions. But first of all, I just want to throw a little encouragement your way. Just take a few minutes to think about the lives that you've touched in the past, how many lives you've touched for good, and then think about how many more you will, Lord willing, when we get back to our regular workflow. Um, I want to mention a possibility to you, something for you to consider. It is totally in your domain. Uh, I don't want anybody to get out of their comfort zone. Just a suggestion, something you can think about. Uh, Deborah is continuing to keep the lessons worked up as in the past. She will take the incoming lessons, um, put them with the student's next lesson, uh, the printed envelopes, etc. puts those in the folders in the classroom just as we have in the past. And we got two pathways here. Uh, one for those who have a, a building access, if you can get into the building, and those who do not. Uh, we'll do the uh, those who have access first. So if you don't have access, stay tuned. We'll get there. Um, we've talked with Dr. Steve Chandler, and as you know, he's coordinating the COVID-19 response at Beltline. He says, if you go to the building, if you go to the classroom, clean your hands going in, clean again coming out. There's a hand cleaner uh, dispenser on the outside classroom wall between the two doors. Um, he also suggests if you happen to go to the classroom, there's someone else there, please observe the uh, proper social distancing rules. Um, what's in the classroom, if you choose to work your lessons there, you can just drop them in the um, uh, mail bin in the back of the classroom. <clears throat> if you want to take them home and work them, that's fine. You can grab one of the grading key sets off of one of the tables. We'll replace those later um, when we uh, get back to our regular, regular operation. Um, if you work them at home, you will then need to bring them back into the classroom, drop them in that mail tray. Deborah will be checking that periodically and making sure that those get back in the mail. Um, if you don't have access, I think probably the best thing would be just to contact Deborah or myself and let's work out something on an individual basis. If you want to be working on those lessons, we're gonna to try to work out a way to make that happen. Um, I will do my best to keep a list of names on our World Bible School website, and I'll put the URL uh, down below here. You can look there to see if you have lessons waiting. In the meantime, stay healthy and hope to see you soon.